my name is sagar welcome to my channel data driven dive so today i am back again with very interesting topic how to create these type of battery chart in excel okay if you see if i change my value here then chart will also change you can see here if i put 50% here then sorry 50% then the chart will be changed if i put uh, any i i put a formula here the rand between rand between means you can put any number uh, bottom value and top value and your range is between these number okay you can give you can drag it to anywhere in your sheet so i double click on that that will uh, again will change and your chart will also change okay so let's see how we can create this type of chart okay so i will add another sheet first what you have to do go to view and remove the grid lines from your page okay so grid lines are removed let's copy that data okay because we need that data okay so what uh, that data means i will explain this okay so first value is quarter these are simple quarter one two three four it is uh, these are our headings in our battery chart okay next we have service level this is our percentage uh, value how much uh, uh, our battery is full this is this shows this service level shows that then we have blank how much our uh, battery is blank okay if it is 50 percent full then 50 percent blank if it has if it is 31 percent full then 69 percent is blank basically uh, here i put a formula what is the formula formula is uh, 100 percent minus this service level okay so i will paste this as value because we have formula okay so formula will like okay i will pay, paste it as value now all our uh, service level paste it as value now we have we have blank level then we have lower cap upper cap middle line one and middle line two what is this so let's see our data so this is our upper cap this one this is our lower uh, lower cap this one and what is the middle line one this is a middle line one and this small white color line shows our middle line two okay if we increase the value of middle line two then it you it will look better okay now you can see middle line two is this okay so for now i will uh, put it as 10 percent so we can see it clearly afterwards after creating a chart we'll make it two percent okay so first we have to create the chart so select the data go to insert and go to this column chart and put this 3d stack column chart here okay so this is our column chart and uh, click in chart design click here switch row and column okay so row and column will be switched and your data is look like that so click on this plus sign and remove axis remove chart title remove grid lines also from our chart okay so all the things are removed i will make it bigger okay now you have to right click on that and go to format for a big, big before formatting what we have to do we need both uh, we need both middle line one and middle line two for lower cap and upper cap okay now we have only middle line one middle line two what we need to do is we copy this control c click on your chart and paste it control b so your lower ca upper cap is also present like that and how we can uh, do it let's see let's click on this chart go to format sorry go to chart design and go to select data okay uh, what we have to do in select data we have to put lower cap up okay let's see make it up then we have middle line one then we have middle line two okay lower cap middle line one middle line two you have to keep the format same okay then we have service level blank then then we have to put middle line two then middle line one then upper cap okay and click on okay so your chart will look like that okay now what we have what i have to do click on this go uh, not we don't need to format chart area we need to just format walls of a chart okay so what we have to do in that 
we we have different option first change the rotation of chart make it 10 percent okay next we have to uh, click on this and format data series in data series uh, gap width will be 50 percent take care of it and this will be 150 percent and column shape will be cylinder okay so you have to make column shape cylindrical okay and close it. now it will look like that okay change the background color of a chart so we can uh, see chart clearly okay so solid fill and we can make it upgraded okay now what we have to do we have to make this upper cap and uh, lower cap change okay so this is our lower cap and this is our upper cap you can see the values here so first we have to change the upper cap so, uh, click on this go to solid fill and make it white color go to lower cap same solid fill and make it white color okay now what we have what you have to do go to this uh, middle line 2 and make it make this also as white color and again go to this middle line 2 you can see check here if your uh, data is correctly selected or not go here and make it solid fill of white color okay now it is it looks good okay now select this this one service level okay so now uh, we have to format this how we can format this we have to format it one by one because we need different color in different cells okay in different batteries sorry so what we have to do if i first click on that uh, then all our, all our service level is selected if you click second time then only this one is selected okay right click on that format data point okay go to this fill option and go to gradient fill first uh, i will take two gradient stop and first i will take green color so first one is light green and second one is a dark green and now uh, type will be linear and direction will be linear right okay you have to uh, remember this okay now you format this come on this double click on this because we have to select this one only solid fill green color and make transparency as 90 percent okay now it will look good and you have to make it also middle line one here and here also we have to make it gradient fill of the same color which we have filled this okay now it is green okay uh, sorry i will select all of these i have to select only this okay you have to double click on this to select only one okay go here go to gradient fill and it is already selected because we have already gradient fill this one now we have to do same thing with this one also gradient fill and it is done now we have to select this this one okay so this one i need uh, some another color so i will select green uh, light blue and dark blue okay press done and we have to do the same thing with this middle line one gradient fill same color and with this also gradient fill same color and this one i need to uh, select a solid fill blue color and transparency will be 90 percent okay take care of these steps because these steps will uh, create a bigger impact on your battery chart okay next i have to select this i will take some another color for that so i will take yellow color for that light yellow and for gradient fill i will take orange color with that okay so now it is done and we have to do same thing with middle line one okay go to gradient fill and it is done and same with this middle line one go to gradient fill and it is done and now we have to make it uh, make changes in blank value solid fill uh, no not solid fill or uh, sorry all the values are changed so yeah so select this blank value and go to solid fill and you can take some like orange color and make it 90 percent 
transfer it. Okay, it will not look good. So first we have like we will take some lesser value. We'll take seventy percent. Okay, then we'll find how it is. Looking. Yeah, it looks good. Okay, then we'll uh, format this chart. So come on this. Select uh, this. We'll increase this value. We'll make this sixty-five percent. Okay. Yeah, now it will look good. So gradient fill, and we will choose some another color here. So I will take red color, dark red, and this one. Okay, and we'll do the same thing with this middle line one. Gradient fill, it is done. We'll do the same thing with this one also. Gradient fill, and it is also done. Now we have to put the blank value, solid fill. Uh, we'll take red color and transparency will be 90%. Okay, so it is. Uh, we are almost done with the chart. Now we can remove the these legends also. Okay, so what uh, now? What we have to do? Uh, to close this. Click uh, right click on this. You don't need to right click. Just click on this. Go here on plus sign and. Uh, right click on data labels click on data labels so data labels will be present here now you can increase the size of this okay bold it and uh, what we uh, what uh, we have to do just now right click on this format data label i need the value from cells because i need service level here so click on value from cells what values i need i need service level okay and click on okay and remove this value now your service level is present here now you can uh, give them the particular color so here we have green color so we can give them green color here we have blue color so we can give them blue color here we have yellow so we can give them like orange here we have red color so we can give them red color. so particular color is present in particular battery okay you can adjust these values as well accordingly okay now we need these quarters also as heading so what we have to do right click on that and uh, click on plus and click on data labels so data labels will be present now what we have to do right click format data label i need category name in here okay so i don't need value so uncheck the value click on category name so category name will be present and now you can increase the size of this category name make it bold and give them a particular color so first i have to give them a green color I have to give them sorry to give them a blue color for this I have to give them orange and for this i have to give red color. okay so now it is ready okay so first check it works or not click on this okay yeah now it works fine what we have to do with it is value and put formula here rent between and put 10 to 95 bracket close we have to go bottom and top value then i want percentage also so click on percentage and you can okay double click on that your value will change and according to value your chart is also changed okay uh, now one more thing i want to tell you uh, just copy this chart okay go to another sheet and go to view remove grid lines okay how we can make another type type of chart copy that chart okay and uh, sorry copy that chart and I don't need to that like a format data series and suppose i need some another type of chart i need box chart so your box chart is created i need full pyramid so your pyramid is created you need partial pyramid so partial pyramid is created you need full cone so you can create cone chart you can create pa uh, partial cone chart so you can create different chart, chart of uh, different type of chart accordingly if you want box chart you can create box chart if you want this type of battery chart so you can create battery chart so this is all for today's session thank you very much 
टेक केयर बाय बाय इफ यू लाइक द सेशन प्लीज सब्सक्राइब इफ यू डेंट लाइक द सेशन प्लीज डिस लाइक द वीडियो and let me know in the chat, uh, chat box what did you dislike about the particular video but if you like the video please subscribe the channel thank you bye bye take care